got the heated gloves, the heated jacket will be next. I've already looked into that. that that'll oh, be there no, for next winter. <laughs> They're <laughs> awesome, mate. Mate, the best thing you can buy in my head, I tell you what, just makes your riding so much more enjoyable in winter. Well, is that the same one? The one I've got to get, it, it just plugs straight into me, um, me battery jumper next to me on the seat and does the whole yeah. thing. Yeah. 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 Don't have to charge it up or anything. Oh, ah, yeah, exactly, yeah. I think we're staying with you guys as well, and so is Schultzy. Okay. And I think even Lizard too, yeah, Lizard? Well, I think so, mate. Well, I thought the place you told me about, I don't know. Yeah, I got yeah, I'm pretty sure. Remember, mate. Yeah, pretty sure we're all together. When, when I went up there last year, I, I couldn't get in there as it was sold out. I booked an Airbnb across the road, I had a two story, four bedroom house, it was fucking massive. <laughs> oh, and, and, it, and it cost me 300 bucks for the whole weekend. Oh, I should have booked that again, we all could have stayed there. Well, yeah, well, I'm not a suggestion, but I thought everybody had already... Wake up the arse. Battle just an Asian parking. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, stop wherever you want to stop, pull up. The yeah, wind's picking up, mate, the breeze are blowing. Well, no, that's the one. If not the wind, we won't get the rain, mate. Oh, mate, yeah. after after we load the Darwin, winds don't worry me anymore. Yeah. You know we're passing the bloody road trains and the. Here comes the rain. Why are you getting a cool camera out? Yeah, I don't know. I'm wrong to just one stopping all the time. I got a backup camera now, Paul. You got a what? A backup camera. Oh, that's good. <laughs> uh, the other one's been blown up and kept going off of it. I don't know if it's settings to be changed. Maybe it's cutting off after every 30 seconds or something. He's a building, somebody. Big buildings out to the left here and these big fair houses. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, aren't they? Huge. And I'll tell you what, that's a new Amazon, isn't it? They go up that bloody quick. Yep. Well, they're building a new Costco out on uh, Pella Road in Ardea. Yeah. They've got Amazon here on the left. I don't know what the other two are behind it. Like all well, the freight places getting built on Tullamarine now behind the airport. They're just, they're beyond, they're beyond big. They're just fucking massive. It's crazy, mate. At least we've got the land out here to build them. Yeah, well, you, you see the new there now. Oh yeah, it's ASL. Yeah. So that's a big, big place of building there. I don't see this one before. What? This one. Oh, well, the yellow thing. Yeah, because we don't come this way. Ah. 
Sydney and we pull up at a roadhouse to get your hot chippies and all that. Oh, yeah, mate. Yeah, you should be able to get good food in the roadhouse, mate. Yeah, exactly. Now, now take away shit. I remember going to Sydney once and the old man had an XPGD and he had the big 120 litre <laughs> bloody fuel tank in it. Oh, pulled, right, up, yeah. pulled up somewhere at about 4 in the morning and back then they used to serve you. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he said, fill it up. Well, the young kid filled it up. He would have been looking underneath the hole. Mate, he uh, started up. We didn't get didn't get outside the driveway and the thing started blowing smoke and all that. He filled it up with diesel. Oh, oh no. <laughs> The old man said, hey, you filled it up with diesel. The kid goes, oh, what do I do? The old man goes, fuck, I'm siphoning it out. <laughs> Siphoned out 120 litres straight into the gutter. Yeah. <laughs> Put, put, put petrol back in it, yeah. let it back then days, and uh, the old man reckons it took about three tanks to blow the yeah. smoke. Oh, yeah, get rid of the smoke. Yeah. Been back in 74, 75. Yeah. That's for the motor, the motor though, you could do that. Yeah, true that. Yeah. That was a nice car, that XP. Nice dark green one, white interior. Uh, pure white? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Perforated bloody um, roof lining. It was a friggin' nice car. Yeah. Pity hasn't got it today. It'd be worth a few bucks. Oh, up and up. Yeah, not not quite as much as an XA though. Yeah, I know. Like XB was probably the mildest out of the lot, I suppose. Yeah, because I only had those two V heads on it. Yeah, the cell's GD. Yeah, the, the they'd be bringing money now, but they the most undesirable GT at the time. Yeah. Yeah, well, he traded it in, mate, for two grand for it. Mate, <laughs> <laughs> you, 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 you. Ancient pride, isn't it? Good old days, eh? Uh, yeah, well, the, the, in the good old days, I used to have compact fairlanes. You used to have 64 fairlanes. Yeah. I, I never paid more than. I never. No, the, the compact fairlane. The small one. Oh, okay. Right, so I, I never used to pay any more than $400. Yeah, it cost you $400 for a door now. <laughs> yeah, true that. Yeah, like the big big tank fair lane, the big bumpers on them. They were uh-huh. a tough looking car. Yeah, I'm a big car person, I love big cars. Yeah, a mate of mine had a, had a hearse. <laughs> a tank fair lane hearse. And we, we went out rather than you get it one night. Mate, the biggest car I had was 77 Mercury Mark E. Uh-huh. Oh, Street Mark fucking solid steel. Wow. Yeah. I had a 77 ZH Fairlane. <laughs> the old man had a couple of uh, Rolls Royce LTDs, the, yeah. the Rolls Royce Bill. Yep. Yeah, that was a nice car too, innit, eh? Yeah, that's one Fairlane I didn't have. Be seen. 
Yeah, that's for sure, mate. 